Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a prom inspired look for you guys. And I'm just starting with my brows today and I'm going to take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Definer in the shade Soft Brown. I'm just going to use a spoolie to brush my brows into place and then just go ahead and fill them in. I'm going to take my brow sculpting gel by Ardell and just run that through my brows to keep them in place all day. And onto the eyes I'm going to use my Maybelline Fit Me concealer and I'm just going to apply that to my lids and blend that out with a beauty blender. So then taking my Tardis Pro palette with the shade Vintage I'm going to apply that to where I've just put my concealer with a little kabuki brush. And I applied some sticky tape from my lower lash line to the end of my brow just to ensure that I get a really um, crisp line when I apply my eyeshadow. So the first eyeshadow I'll be taking is the shade Bold on a Morphe blending brush and I'm just going to apply that through my crease. The next shade I'll be taking is the shade Edgy on a small tapered blending brush and I'm just going to create a little C shape on my outer corner and then take this colour about a third of the way into my eyelid. shade I'll be taking is the shade Smoked on a small pencil brush and I'll just be placing that on my outer corner and bringing it a third of the way in, same as what we just did before and then just grabbing that small blending brush and blending it all together. Then I'm going to take my big fluffy blending brush that I started with and I'm just going to make sure everything is all blended together. I'm going to take the shade Punk and I'm just going to do that same technique with that little pencil brush. So just the C and then bringing that in a third of the way and then just blending it together with that small blending brush. And again, just going over with that large fluffy brush that we started with and making sure everything is all blended out seamlessly. I'm just removing that tape and as you can see, we've got a nice crisp line of shadow there. Um, so then I decided I wanted to add a thin liner across the top of my lid. I decided to use the Punk eyeshadow on an angle brush as I didn't want to use a liquid liner because I thought it would be a little bit too intense for this look. So for my eyelid colour today, I'm going to take the shade Shimmer Shimmer by Makeup Geek on a flat shade of brush and I'm just going to apply that all over my lid and then I'm also going to take some of that shade down into my inner corners as well. So moving on to my face, today I'll be using the original primer by Astralis. This is really good for oily skin types. Um, then I just went ahead with my see you later pores and put that on my nose and chin area. For foundation I'll be using my designer brands New Beige and Paulson Beige and just mixing those together and applying them to the skin with my beauty blender and just blending that all in. So then to conceal I use my Maybelline Fit Me concealer again and just concealing all the same areas as I usually do. 
Then I took my sleek palette and I used the shade, I think it's Renaissance Gold. And then I just applied that to my nose, my cupid's bow, my cheeks, my temples, and just above my brow. To set my face in place, I took my RCMA powder on a big fluffy powder brush and just applied that all over the face. Then to bronze up my face, I took my Hula by Benefit bronzer with my angled brush and applied that to my cheeks, my temples, my forehead, and down either side of my nose. To further intensify my highlight, I took the Mary Luminizer by the Balm on the fan brush and just applied that to all the areas that I applied the cream highlighter to. And to finish off my eyes, I took the shades Edgy and Punk on this, um, I think it's like a fluffy shader brush, I'm not sure. And I just put those two colours on my lower lash line and blended them out with that brush. And I went ahead and added my 3D eyelashes by Luxurious and some Lash Sensational Mascara by Maybelline. Then I decided to also add some black liner in my waterline as well, just to intensify the look a little bit more. So for lips today, I used my Kylie Jenner liquid lip in the shade Kristen, and then I also applied an Essence lip liner in just a red shade. I'm not sure what the name of it is. Then I just set my makeup in place with my MAC Fix Plus setting spray, and that's the end of this tutorial. So thanks guys for so, so much for watching, and please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks guys.